Hello, sir. Howdy. So, you are claiming that you and Beatrice Luzier were childhood sweethearts? That's right. Of course, her name wasn't Luzier back then. It was Birds. And yes, we were sweet for each other. And what's your name, sir? My name is Billy Bob Campbell. Forgive me for saying so, Billy Bob, but you don't sound like you're from West Virginia. A lot of my ancestors migrated from North Virginia. That's all kind of people in North Virginia who talk like me. So I reckon I still got that accent. But that didn't get in the way of my communicating with my love for Beatrice, my sweet little Beatrice. So you two were school-age sweethearts? We used to sneak away, go down to the Ohio River, and play in the mud together. Sometimes I even steal a little smooch. This was in 1940s. It was war time. Children back then didn't do all the crazy stuff that they do today. And after the war, high school? Well, we kind of drifted apart after that. I was Catholic and I had to go to Catholic high school. Beatrice and I didn't see much of each other after that. And then she went off to WVU and met Bill, her future husband. And what happened to you, Billy Bob? I went to college out east, then business school. I got my MBA and made a fortune in textiles. But I kept track of Beatrice and always admire her for going to teaching. She just had that kind of loving and caring nature that makes for a good teacher. And I'm so proud to know her. Do you know what we used to do back then when we were kids? Every year, at this time around Valentine's Day, I would dress up like Cupid, and me and Beatrice would go down to the drugstore, and i buy her a raspberry pop. That was her favorite. People would laugh at my silly costume, but I didn't care. It made Beatrice smile. Hey, wait. I might could still have that costume after all these years. No. Yeah, buddy. I'll be right back. Beatrice, my dear friend, happy birthday. Won't you be my valentine of this special occasion? Just like the old days when we were kids. Here, this is for you.